The three remaining guys from the Try Guys have released their first video after former Try Guy slash wife guy Ned Fulmer was confirmed to be cheating on his wife with one of the show's producers. Eugene Liang, Zach Kornfield and Keith Habersberger posted a solemn five-minute video to YouTube and the group's socials on Tuesday. In it, the trio sat together on a couch and updated everyone on the timeline of events that has unfolded in the last few weeks. Again we urge you to strap in because this is yet another ride. Ned Fulmer is no longer working with the Try Guys, Zach began. We want to give you a timeline of what's transpired and some transparency into our decision making. Throughout this video, there will be things that we want to say or go into further but as I'm sure you're aware there are some legal things we have to consider as we go through everything. Keith admitted the three of them only found out about Ned's behavior when fans began sending them DMs after he had been spotted in public with the producer. The trio then revealed Ned confirmed the rumors and said that the affair had been going on for some time. Thus began a three-week process of engaging with employment lawyers, corporate lawyers, HR, PR and more in order to make sure we were taking all the necessary steps, Eugene continued. From the jump, we were acutely aware of just how contrary this was to the values of the company we've built and those of everyone who works here. This is something we took very seriously, we refuse to sweep things under the rug. That is not who we are and not what we stand for. Since then, the Try Guys team has been working to remove Ned from the company's video channels. They've taken down his series and even gone as far as to digitally edit him out of other videos. The scripted message aside, we simply have to stop and look at the body language of each of the Try Guys in this video. Zach looks like he hasn't slept for weeks and could burst into tears at any second, and he gets close a couple of times in the video. Keith exudes peak disappointed dad energy and Eugene has an unbridled death stare on him that makes me feel like I've done something wrong. Zach confirmed multiple videos will never see the light of day because of Ned's involvement in them. There are several videos we deemed fully unreleasable, he said. You will never see them and that is due to his involvement. That's a decision that has cost us lots of money. We will not be able to recoup that money, but it's a decision we stand by proudly. Keith said Ned's behavior was unbecoming of what the Try Guys company is all about and the group formally removed him in mid-September. It also meant this TikTok has not aged well whatsoever. On Friday, September 16 the three of us signed written consent of the members of Second Try LLC approving the removal of Ned as a manager and an employee, he said. We chose not to rush into the announcement for a few reasons, namely there are real people who have been affected and, while we consider this a company matter, there's also a family at the center of this. The trio also noted there will be some videos coming out in the future that will still include Ned because they're branded content that they've already committed to. So when you see a video that's sponsored in a few weeks and think oh that's kinda weird, yeah it is kinda weird, but that's just how things are, Keith said. They also stressed for everyone to exercise kindness in comments and conversations and to respect the privacy of those who may be caught up in all the drama. Eugene said there's more to come in regards to how they'll move forward as a company and a creative team. Zach finished off the video by thanking everyone for their support and that they look forward to introducing everyone to the next era of the Try Guys. Image, YouTube, the Try Guys.